What's up, nieces? What's up, nephews? What's the dealio? Yo, I'm back with another video. <clears throat> mm-hmm. Oh, big A got us, then. As usual. I thought she was getting ready to tell some shit. You know what I'm saying? I was like, what? So she talked to her daddy. And she told me she, her and her daddy always, they always talked. I thought I recall one time in her video she said her and her daddy didn't get along. I don't know. I can't keep up. She from left to right, all the way around. You know what I'm saying? I do recall her saying one time her and um, her daddy didn't talk that often or that much or whatever, something. And I believe it, too, because she just said him and his, her and the girlfriend, a wife, whatever there is to a stepmom or girlfriend is to the daddy, she said they had a physical altercation, so you know, I mean, her and the daddy had words, but you know, like I said, it's too much to keep up with. But I, I, that's just what I think. I thought, do anybody else remember that? But yeah, I really thought that she had something to, um, I thought she was getting ready to say something. Hell yeah, I would click in for it. Mm, I want to know. What's going on? I don't know. I mean, when she, especially when she started that, where the title got me, like, oh, she got something on them, you know, she gonna say, but, mm -mm. I think she trying to change or something because normally, you know, she would have went right on in or whatever. So maybe she is changing. Mm hmm. See, you know, they ain't got, they're not talking about her, so I guess she's saying, well, they ain't talking about me, so I'm not going to talk about them. That might be the situation, but you can't talk about them. Why even put them in the, why even put them in the, in the title? What I, I don't understand. You can't talk about them. Stop making us chase the video, girl. And come with the real juice and tea. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Go on and tell it for somebody else. Tell it. You know? Unless they have got that um piece of paper on your ass. There's the only way I can see why you ain't telling it. Um, well, maybe it's out of respect for your daddy. Huh? Okay, enough of that. But about her and old Greggy, as she say, Greggy, Greggy. Hmm. Man, I ain't see the um the one they said. You know, they is the thing about it is she gonna okay, she gonna play this role with him. She gonna have to change her ways. That man ain't stupid. You know, I mean either. I don't see him, well, he may be, you know, dumbing down. He may, you know, be dumbing down just to keep, you know, keep getting what he's getting. You know what I'm saying? But she going to have to level up fucking with him. He ain't in that nice house like he is because he don't know nothing. You know, you know, he like to talk about, you know, he was talking about, um, Africa and something that was growing over there in Africa and all that other type of shit. You know what I'm saying? Maybe that's why she was looking at the TV because she couldn't relate. You know? That's all I'm saying. That's why I say you better start. Hell yeah. Or you better start leading the conversation one. But if you getting ready to make it believable to him... You gonna have to get on your gang, baby. Yeah, you gonna have to go and get on that. <clears throat> okay.
motherfucker. He ain't like the rest. And moving in, are you? Let me see. Where that damn phone is? I just had it in. Yeah. And that ain't the one. That, that again, another clip bait. Tell me she, she was going to give us the tour. It was a little bit. He told her not to because she did. You did with just a little taste. They want no real tour. Didn't really show the bathroom where that little tub you showed that. But. Yeah. Uh, this damn phone is getting on my nerve today. Now, this one normally let me do what I do and let it last, and I can talk for hours, but I downloaded, uh, I downloaded uh, a spade game. And it ain't been the same since. As soon as I start talking, it'll be like, you need to check your files and shit. I'm like, what? And you know this one already done, you know, got me on the time limit. Like, nah, motherfucker, no. Not even having it. But, um. Yeah. I was like. Moving in? You know you ain't moving in with that boy. You are not moving in with that man, girl. You really gonna have to buy down. Move in with him you want to. Go ahead and mess with that man if you don't know how to work it. That's all I'm saying. Cause he seemed like a good guy, but you know, hey, we don't know. We don't know. And she don't either. I mean, I don't think, my thing is, that's why you got to be, that's why I say, it ain't even nothing wrong meeting people because you know opposite do attract so you know we all know that there's possible the opposite do attract so you can't say he don't like whatever whatever but they just have to get you know their levels together you know because i mean ain't nothing wrong cause, okay she don't drink coffee but want to you know uh light one up for her breath for her coffee hey he need he okay, you gonna have to respect that. I, I mean, you know, certain things she gonna have to compromise with him. And certain things he gonna have to compromise with her. And what I would do if I'm gonna move the hell in, I need to know his your expectations. Then I'm gonna tell you mine. So the key thing is to communicate, because if you don't go communicating, how is how is either one of you supposed, supposed to get to know each other, even though it is about a bag, you know? <laughs> yeah. I'm just saying. I told you, if you don't know the story, go check out the story with Anna Nicole and... Uh, that friend, that old man, she picked up. And that motherfucker, that was like, that motherfucker, that was a billionaire. I ain't lying, that motherfucker was, I just looked at it. You know what I'm saying? I looked at it. I see, I seen it. That about my fourth or fifth time. I just like watching it. I like her anyway, Anna Nicole. But, I mean, it's just the way he just, I mean, you know what I'm saying? I was just thinking, like, you know, if I did run across somebody that was that rich and just that was that infatuated with me or just was that into me and told me don't worry about nothing, go spend this, go spend that. 
I don't think I would go and just blow no damn money. I don't think I'd do that. I would go get what the fuck I want. You know, and shit that I had probably been wishing for. But first of all, before I do that, I'm going to get something that I can fall back on. You know, that materialistic shit going to come. Because I already told you he 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 rich, he billionaire. So I know they're going to come, the clothes, the shoes, the jewelry, and whatever the hell else the cause. But let me get some type of foundation, you know, for some type of security. Because shit, after it's gone, them shoes, clothes, and all the other type of shit, they ain't going to pay no bill. They ain't going to put no food on the table yet, Will, if you sell it. But I'm just saying. You know, get your shit right. Give a damn. Do your thing, you know. And unless you're just in it for um, he do him and you do you. And if you're in it for that, how you happy? Because, I mean, you know, it's all according to what you're in it for. But if you're moving the fuck in, it's more than a you do you and I do me. It's more than that. And for you motherfucking flies and roaches that want to say it ain't none of my business and da 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 shut the fuck up. It is my damn business. As long as she put it out there and <laughs> for people to see, I can speak on it if the fuck I want to. She don't want to be said or nobody talk about it. I'm sure what she don't want motherfuckers to know or see about her, she ain't putting it on YouTube, okay? So whatever she putting the fuck out there, it's okay with her for somebody to come along and talk about it. That's the way I feel. Same thing with me. Hmm. Get over it, because I do. You know, I'm so sick of y'all, motherfucker. Oh, she this, she that. Ain't nobody trying to put her down. She do what the fuck she want to do. Yeah, I don't pay her bills. Just because I'm sitting up here giving my opinion or stating something, my opinion, uh, or whatever, that's um, about something that she already done put out there. I'm supposed to be fucked up? No. Hell no. If I want to speak on it, I can speak on it. Shit. It's the damn same thing as if I would go and, sp and uh, say it in the comments. On her video, ain't it? Y'all do too damn much. You gonna fuck around. You gonna, you gonna fuck right around, you roaches and flies. You gonna run right into a bank of raid. Mm-hmm. Instantly. Just like that. Dead. So, just leave it alone. Come watch quietly and nicely. And not this over, get the fuck on. We don't need to hear what the fuck you got to say, because it don't matter. It do not matter. But, with that being said, it's blinking. This damn phone getting on my nerves. You hear me? 14 minutes. This, this motherfucker game. And then, like I said, I don't even know what the hell is up with this damn phone here. Because normally I could get like a whole damn hour of this. I think what it was I recorded, but I, I sit here and deleted about 10 apps off this phone, and it's still talking about storage. So I don't know what the fuck. I don't know what the hell. You understand what I'm saying? They get. I know it's getting on my nerves. It's really getting on my nerves. I can't do what I want to do. Because, see... This one right here will let me go. I might still can do this. No, I'm going to have to go live to do that. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, don't y'all forget to subscribe, comment, like, and share. Y'all share my video. I don't know if y'all doing it or not, but, you know. Let me see. Let me find out. Okay. Like. Subscribe, comment, and share. And yeah, I might come back with a live if I can get this.